My view has always been uh, this is a choice. It is not a mandate. The, the unborn uh, person uh, doesn't have constitutional rights. Uh, so in the uh, third trimester mm -hmm. of pregnancy, uh, there is room for uh, looking at the life and the health of the mother. Hillary went to visit the ladies on ABC's The View Monday, where she was asked when an unborn child has constitutional rights. And, and Secretary, I want to ask you about some comments that you made over the weekend mm -hmm. on Meet the Press regarding abortion. You said, quote, the unborn person doesn't have constitutional rights. And my question is, at what point does someone have mm -hmm. constitutional rights? And are you saying that a child on its due date, just hours before delivery, still has no constitutional rights? Under our law, that is the case, uh, Paula. I support Roe v. Wade um, because I think it is... Um, an important statement about um, the importance of a woman making this most difficult decision uh, with consultation uh, by whom she chooses, her doctor, her <coughs> faith, her family. Um, and under the law and under certainly that decision, that is the way uh, we structure it. When do you think an unborn child has constitutional rights? Share and comment below.